Okay, for homework 224, for math readiness, I'd like you to copy all these problems down and then write down the three words to show me that you were listening. All right, but here we go. You need to know when I give you these angles, whether they're equal and you set them equal to each other like those two, or the angles that I give you that when you plus them together, give you 180. So again, sometimes they're equal, sometimes they're supplementary. You add them up to 180. The first word is supplementary. All right, so here we go. For this first one, because they're equal, I'm gonna set these two equal to each other. So I'm gonna set 6x plus one equal to 3x plus 10. You need to know how to solve a variables on both sides. Start by getting rid of the plain number on the left and then go to the right and get rid of the variable on the right and then go back to the left and divide. So these first two steps involve adding, subtracting terms and numbers, adding, subtracting stuff. Get rid of that plain number by doing the opposite. Get rid of that 3x by doing the opposite. Finally, this third step is something different than adding, subtracting, division. So you can see, after all that work, I get x equals 3, which is not the degrees. It's the number I could use to plug into one of these to times it and then add to get that. So that's what I'd like you to do. Second word is blue, blue. So to find the angles, take that X number, which is three, and plug that in for X, and then do the math. So I got three times three plus 10. That will give me nine plus 10. That gives me 19. So that is the degree right there, 19 degrees. So that angle, I'd like you to write them in there. This is 19 degrees. X is three, but the angle is 19. If that's 19, this is 19. Alternate interior, 19. If that's 19, I plug in three into this one right here would also give me 19. Now, to get those other numbers, know that if you know half the angle's 19, and you know the total is 180, which is supplementary, if I take 180 minus that 19, it will give me what that angle has to be. So if I take 180, take away 19, what's left is what that angle would have to be. So when I add up, it gives me 180. So that angle I could see is 161 degrees. If that's 161, this is 161. Alternate interior, 161. Vertical, 161. You need to know that. All right, last problem. These are not equal, they're supplementary. So I'm gonna take 3x <coughs> plus 30 and take that 5x plus 10 and set that equal to 180. So this problem, I need to combine like terms and then start my inverse operation. So 3x and 8x, I'm sorry, 5x gives me 3, 8x, 30 plus 10 gives me 40. And now I can start my inverse operations. Take away this 40 right here. Bring down this 8x. This is 140, divide by eight, gives me what just the X number is. Doesn't give me the angles, but just the X number. So 140 divided by eight gives me 17.5. Knowing for this one, when I plug in X, I gotta do the math for both, or I could plug into one, and take the other one away from 180 to find the other angle. But no matter what, you're gonna have to take that X and plug that into one of them and see what you get. So let's see, if I have five 
times that 17.5 plus 10 gives me 87.5 plus 10 is 97.5. If I want to find that other angle next to it, I could take 975 away from 180 to get that angle, which would have to be 82.5 because 82.5 and 97.5 give me 180. Or I could take that 17.5, plug it in for X, and do the math for that one gives me 52.5 plus 30 is 82.5. Another way to get that, either by plugging in or by taking what you got away from 180. That's another way to get that 82.5. But now you know all the angles, put them in there. This angle 82.5 degrees because these are corresponding corresponding angles equal this is 97.5 this is 97.5 because of also corresponding angles or because straight angles add up to 180 and then fill in all the rest vertical angles this is 97.5 degrees another vertical angle this is 82.5 degrees a corresponding or for this one alternate interior equal so fill in all those angles give me all the answers for x show all this work third word is fish fish good luck